First of all, you told me the other day it's only one way to get back to the top, and you're doing it right now. Yeah, that's the main thing, you know, get back into it, you know. If you strike out, you got to get back in the battle, bo battle, battle box and uh, try to hit that grand slam. I mean, you didn't have no uh, tomato can in front of you today. Mento came to fight. Yeah, Mento definitely came to fight. He came to win. You know, tough guy, man. I hit him with a couple punches. He didn't go down. And then the second time, you know, it took me a while to get him down. And he was slumped over the ropes, and usually they would call it. So I'm like, you know what? Fine, you're going to let me tee off. I'm going to tee off on him. All right. Now, uh, you hurt your hand in this fight on his head? You no, know, it, it hurt. Like in the third round, I think hit him with a solid jab on his face. And uh, I had to go back because it, it really hurt. But right now, it, it's better. Yeah. You know, people talk about conditioning and weight. But you know what? At 263, I saw a fast and a nimble on his feet, Chris Ariola tonight. Yeah, that's for sure. You know, all credit to that goes to, you know, uh, Daryl Hudson, man. Working my ass off every week, every day. Uh, doing bleachers, doing all kinds of calisthenics and stuff like that. So all praise go to him. And now... I got to lay off that food at night, man. That's it. Honest to God, man. Middle of the night, I get hungry and I got to eat. It's that discipline that you can have in the ring, that discipline you got to have in the belly, too, baby. Yeah, especially when I'm at home by myself, you know. Okay, all the best, man. Congrats, Thank baby. You. you know it.